um, people are now more interested in careers regarding women. They are more interested in careers and therefore the age of marriage is a little later than was there about 15 years ago. Do you want to pay? That's point number one. Point number two is uh, the incidence of uh, obesity is higher and uh, the incidence of polycystic ovaries seems to be higher. Poly? Polycystic ovaries. Polycystic ovaries seems to be higher. What does this mean? Uh, there are small vortices in the ovaries which uh, delay the release of the egg. Uh, how does this happen? It's considered to be genetic but then it worsens because of obesity and that can also be compounded by bad eating habits, a lot of junk food, those sort of things. Surrogacy is two types. One is where only the womb is the surrogates. The, the baby is theirs, their own egg and their own sperm. The second variety is the surrogate also donates the egg and then the husband's sperm is there. Ending intercourse, that's number one. How is Step that? number two, uh, the uh, most fertile period in a person with regular cycles is between the 13th and the 20th day of the cycle. Mm -hmm. So that's step number one. Step number two is we give them tablets and or injections and then we do scans to find out when they ovulate and ask them to have intercourse at that time. Step number three is the same thing. Mm -hmm. We give tablets, injections, we do scans to find out when they ovulate and then we do an insemination. So that is artificial insemination. And option number four is we do IVF. O option number three. Three is uh, the uh, IUI. First is timed intercourse. Right. Second is the uh, ovulation induction. We call it ovulation induction. What happens in this ovulation induction? We give tablets, injections, and then we induce. Uh, ovulation means release of the egg. Okay. And then we ask them to time intercourse at that time. Okay. And number three is we uh, do an IUI. Number four is we do a test tube baby. 